Hey guys, we're back for more Fallout, and today we're going to try and get that power armor. And I figured out that there's a couple methods. Let's see if I can do the one where I don't need to try and pass a repair check. See if he'll let me. Let's see. So who is the leader? That would be Elder Maxon. Thank you. And some better weapons. You were entitled to a few things. You have proven yourself an initiate. Doesn't mean you can start handing over weapons. Let's see. Brother Jason, how can I help you? <laughs> okay. Let's see. He's the great great grandson, or. Was it great, 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 great grandson? Well, he's a descendant of one of our founding members, and he is the High Elder. Thanks. Let's see, I don't think I've got a high enough, uh, or I do have a high enough reputation. How do I? It seems like I do. Let's see. Hmm. Seems like I can't do much, so we're going to try and go ahead and fix the armor instead. Seems like he just isn't going to give it to me, or give me the quest to try and get power armor. I have a high enough things, or... Let me see if I can find it on the Fallout wiki. Let's see... Pull the guards and lock. So it's optional to speak to him, so I could probably do it without it if I wanted to. Let's try it, I guess. First, let me, uh. fucking grab the new armor from. uh, Ian. Because he has that combat armor we got earlier on him. Yeah, grab it. Where is it? He's got so much shit in here now. Does he not have him on it? Did I not grab it? I may not have grabbed it. Unless I have it on right now. I guess I don't. Maybe I didn't grab it. Hmm. Doesn't matter much to me. Since I'm getting power armor immediately. I'll probably be able to... uh Take them out. I mean, I've got the fucking alien blaster, the best weapon in the game. Go to ground level. That was kind of a weird glitch with the door. I kind of went in right as it closed. Alright, we have to go to the hub's uh, old town. Or downtown, is it? I think it's downtown. To rescue an initiate member. Oh, we gotta go to the hub. <laughs> Keep wandering.
Maybe I'll find another alien blaster. I do have that uh, plasma rifle, but still my, uh, what is it? Energy weapons are not that high. Let's see, we need to go to downtown. And then apparently there's a Brotherhood of Steel member who's stuck somewhere? Or is it an old town? It's an old town. Okay. Then later I have to harden the power armor, which is, uh, it may, it's not harder, it's just I have to do another step. I gotta like get a chemistry journal or something. So it's right here. Switch over. We should save. So that we don't fuck about and then get killed. I got hit critically for that. I just need a better... Got him. I'm an alien, motherfucker. Hmm, got hit for 14. Now I'm just getting punched. Man, they're giving me an assault. Yeah, I died. So let's try and reload that save. I know I can kind of throw shit in through the uh, windows. Uh, do I have any grenades on me other than all the ones that are inside of him? Okay, so I want to look at this anyway. Let's see. So I need to get my grenades from Ian. Let's see. Where are they at? Frag grenades. Incinerary rounds. That should be enough. Let's. I don't have a very big throwable skill, but we'll see what happens if I can just chuck it in there and hope for the best. Shit, he sees me. Fuck. Seems like that should have hit him, but okay. Got him. I should throw on my alien rifle, or alien gun. Thank <laughs> you. 
So many stimp packs. Oh, it was a crit. Okay, so it's a little bit tough, I'll tell you that. I guess he does have, like, Tesla armor on. Damn, he does a lot. I hit dog meat. Jeez, I don't think I'm going to be able to make it out of this. Dog meat's okay. I just hit him really fucking hard. Why? Okay, we need to reload a save. I can't let dog meat die. For all the pain, he's super useful because mostly enemies don't attack him. It's his friend that does all that fucking damage. Oh, crit.
Okay, I need to make sure that I save right here. Because if I accidentally hit uh, dog meat, then I'm fucked. I don't want to hit dog meat. Yeah, I killed dog meat. Fuck. Alright. Reload. Got him. Oh, okay. I was confused. I was like, why isn't it giving it to him? It's just that we have so much shit on us. Probably this plasma rifle is... Weighing us down way too much. need everybody away from here. I think I may have lost that uh, Tesla armor now. See, was I able to pick it up? No, I wasn't able to. Well, that fucking sucks. Come on, I just want to pick up all this shit. Okay, it's better just to kind of... We did all we could. Good thing we've got our lockpick skill. Oh, it's because the gang won't move out of the fucking way. There we go. Move out. We weren't able to get that Tesla armor, which I really wanted, but I think there's a place you can pick it up just for free, pretty much. Also, I'm glad none of the guards tried to attack me. I do have an alien gun, so probably a bad idea to mess with a guy with an alien gun. Unless you have that Tesla armor. That guy, if I didn't get that crit, he probably would have killed me again fucking tesla armor i guess i learned very useful against plasma weapons i'm glad not a lot of the enemies actually use that stuff if they did i'd be scared like i know that raider guy uses it we should really take out the cons now just because like now we have the firepower to fucking blow them off the map not just from the alien blaster, but also from the, uh, the Gatling laser. <laughs> what is it? Plasma rifle. That I haven't used at all just because, like, don't got enough power. Level one. <laughs> all right.
You saved Jonathan. Power armor. From Michael. Cool. Are you Michael? Who's Michael? I'm guessing he's the guy that repairs the power armor. Let's see. Guessing level two. Why are the doors closed so quickly? Just a pain. Don't think this is it. Oh, I'm back. I think I need to help out the hub with a problem if I want to make the uh, power armor hardened. Kyle. I fix stuff. Where is Michael? Night, Paul. Let's see. I need to figure out who the hell Michael is. Out. One, where is Michael? I'm thinking that's, yeah, it's the guy up there. I've, okay, so you hold down shift and you click and you run as fast as you want. Run like a fucking jackrabbit. So it was the guy up top that was like right outside the room. I'm glad I didn't have to ask him to do it. Would have been fucking stupid for me to try and raise up the reputation. Just so I could just go out and do it when I figured out it's just completely optional. See, I've been authorized to check something out. The terminal. See, well, it doesn't matter. Here's your armor. Be sure. No, nah, that's it. All right, power armor. Yes. That's it. We also have combat armor now, which is okay. All right. Now we are true Brotherhood of Steel. Let's see. Barter, meaning I'm just going to give you a bunch of shit I still have. So you check all this in there. I didn't even read those hollow tapes. All don't want to give him the scorpion. Be very bad if he had that. Okay, offer. There we go. And there we go. Okay, so now that we've done that, I've pretty much gotten through that. Oh, he's mad. Where am I? See, so talk to General Maxon on the fourth floor. Okay. Oh yeah, I should check my stats. See if that raised up some stuff. Check my character. Yeah, it pretty much improves your strength and shit. 
So now I've got 9 strength, meaning I can hold any gun now. <laughs> also, if I punch things, I'm probably like a god. I've pretty much become a god by now. Alright, we need to go to the 4th floor. Go see Maxon. Not the Maxon from Fallout 4, though. Just the Maxon from Fallout 1. Cabot said you wanted to talk. Look, I'm uh, I'm pretty stacked up right now, so I'll uh, I'll help you out as long as you don't start flapping your gums too much. You know, outsiders are like that, always jawing. <laughs> Gotta like me, huh? Sure. Look, I don't have time for a shoot. Well, you see, there's four of them. And that's about all they can ever agree on. They can't even agree if they want to piss. Much less pick a pot to piss in. Mm. Then get out. I have work to do. Alright, dude. Hello, initiate. Sorry, I thought you were someone else. Let's see, how do we get to over there? I'm guessing it's through here. I gotta go back through here again. Why'd you bring a dog to the Brotherhood of Steel? I like dog. My dog is here. Let's see. See if I'm allowed through so I can talk to the elders about the whole super mutant thing. Greetings, initiate. There's an urgent matter I need you to help me with. It's Max, and we're pretty sure he's gone off the deep end. He keeps ba babbling about an army passing up north. Someone who can get to an honest report. Are you willing to do it? Yeah, I'll do it. Good. First, go talk to Max if you haven't already. Report back to me when you've checked the northern territory. After that, we'll decide what to do with Max. And wish me luck. Where is Maxon, anyway? Where is he? Let's see... I don't know where he is. Where is Elder Maxon? Okay, that is Elder Maxon. Okay, I was confused. Because he doesn't look like the Elder Maxon from, uh... Like, the ending scenes. He, lo he looks like an old man. What the hell do you want now? Shoot. Let's see. Oh, just another stupid rumor. Some people say it's a huge fanged monster, and others say it's a vampire. Shoot. Our main goal is to survive. The scribes copy old plans for weapons or design new ones, and the knights make guns from them. Most guns come from us. Sure. Let's see. Then get out. I have work to do. Had to do a little uh, on me. So let me check the pip. Captain Maxim is right. This place is death. I'm riding here so I don't make it. Oh, this is the stuff from when he was when that random dude died. Okay. Let's see, confide to you that he's worried about. Volunteer to scout the area for him. Go.
go northwest across the desert if the mountain in the mountains near the four corner right you'll west of Vault 13 you'll find a fortress guarded by mutants. Okay. Is Maxon just not gonna confide in me? Sorry, I forgot your name. My name is Mathia. I'm officially his assistant. Okay. What the hell do you want now? Army. Well, I believe there's an army massing to the north and in the mountains to the east. But I don't have any way to prove it. The elders, they won't even listen. What was that? No, I... Shoot. Well, I believe there's an army massing to the north and in the mountains to the east. But I don't have any way to prove it. The elders, they won't even listen. Then get out. I... So what it, we have to do is go to the Mariposa military base. So we need to go all the way up and out of the Brotherhood's bunker. We've got power armor, and apparently I don't even need to fight the super mutants. I just need to get in there, uh, see that they're super mutants, and then get out. Back to ground level. I'm technically part of the Brotherhood. And that's one thing the Vault Dweller could have done at the end of the game. Instead of, like, making Aurora, he could have gone and joined the Brotherhood for a long time. I guess he just didn't want to do it. Let's see. You head north. Oh, we ran into something. Super mutants. We'll see what happens. I don't think we can make it out of this alive. Fuck. Wait, the last loaded game was... Shit, that's pretty far back. At least I can try and get the uh, armor that he had. Let's see, barter. Need to drop a bunch of this shit off inside of his uh, inventory once more because we got thrown back all the way. All right, we're back. Uh, just had to redo all that shit that we did. Nuka Cola truck. That's a lot of caps. That's a lot of schmeckles. I mean, I guess it is a Nuka-Cola truck, so it would have a lot of bottle caps. 
All right, we're still heading towards the uh, base. Still trying to find it. Oh. Tough not to crack. Otherwise known as, I don't want to fight anybody. We're going to go straight back to the Brotherhood to tell them about this. My name is Sergeant Moron, and I am here to destroy you. Random. Random stop. Cool, I guess. I sustained two points. Let's see. Leave, go. You find... You can leave the fortress without fighting any mutants. Return to them and report your findings to Elder Maxon. Or General Maxon. Alright, and then we'll talk to all of them to try and talk about what the hell we're going to do with all these mutants. A lot of walking everywhere. I hear it may get better in Fallout 2, just because you can you can drive a car. Hello again, Initiate. Uh, things going well? Yeah, I found some information. What do you got? See, I saw their base. It's crawling with mutants. Finally. Well, this will get the elders off their butts. We'll fortify the fortress and surprise those damn mutants. Damn. Can't play on defense this one, Maxon. So, uh, what is your alternative? See, so not quite sure what we should do right now. Let me gather more information. Should be best to attack the mutants before they attack us. We're gonna need the elders on our side for this one. Not a bad plan. Tell you what, let me go try and beat it into the elders. No guarantees, but I'll try. All right. Have called a meeting. Do you wish to meet? All right, it's up top. I know that because I. Mm, was brought there. Alright. I should probably save in case uh, there's a couple speech checks that I may or may not fail. Like, I've got full speech, but it's like, what if they're like, oh, we need 120 speech? And it's like, damn, why the hell does it have to be so high? We've gotten pretty far. Just that one little run-in with the super mutants fucked me over, just because it, they killed Ian and uh, dog meat. So it just, it turned out pretty bad. See, the meeting will come to order. All elders are present and agreed on hearing out the Brother Jason. <laughs> we shall determine what actions have been taken. Brother Jason, tell us what you've seen up north. During my explanation, I found a military installation run by mutants. They had large humanoids. Their muscle mass was way, belong, way beyond a regular human could gain. Guarding troops. What threat do you assume? Just as the Brotherhood gearing up for battle, this mutant army is preparing for something big. Frankly, the report has not shown us any proof of what their threat they are. The proof gathering an army, a heavily armed army, and they certainly aren't going to parade around. They intend to use it. Well, they are on their way here. The brother is the only real opposition they could have. Print of strike against their military base? Yes, I don't want them to know we're coming, though. A small team would stand a better chance of getting into their perimeter without being detected. So be it. You shall have three paladins of my choosing... To meet you at the military base to help you and you get inside. Elders, thank you for their time. Okay, then. The Brotherhood to help. Okay, what's up next? Head to the council room. Return to the military base. You will be met by three paladins from the Brotherhood. Let's see. I should really... I need to ask, or I need to steal from Ian again. Ian, give me shit. Give me shit, man. Let's see. Random sledgehammer. Let's see, we need that uh, artillery gun. Or <laughs> the plasma rifle. I don't know what kind of uh, rounds it uses, though. I'm guessing it uses these rounds. Shit, I can't pick them up. Fuck, okay. Uh, uh, give away that combat rifle, and then that, and then that, and we don't need this. 
See, we really don't need that Rad X anymore. Don't need this combat rifle. Don't need this combat armor. Oh, he doesn't have any space left. Shit. Okay, we're gonna have to get rid of some shit. Let's see, how do I just get rid of stuff? I don't know how to get rid of stuff. <laughs> I didn't know he had a space problem. Uh, Fallout 1, how to drop stuff. Hold left click over. Oh, that's right. There's like a little menu I forget about sometimes. Drop this. Let's see, I just need to get rid of this. Okay. Head's kind of fucked up there for a second. Barter. Or no, bartering won't do anything. He wants money for my shit back. And it's like, no, I'll just steal it back from you. Have my shit back. Let's see. I need the uh, rounds for that thing. Can't really use it unless I have them. Yes. And then if I'm going to carry around that combat shotgun, I should really use it. Guns and bullets. Let's see, where are all of the uh, shotgun rounds we had? Do we not have any more shotgun rounds? Do we drop them somewhere? Click, click, click. Okay, we do have shotgun rounds. Okay. That should be enough. Flip this back over and then grab the plasma rifle. There it is. It uses micro fusion cell. Yeah, we've got enough ammo for a while, I'd say. I know there's such thing as the turbo uh, plasma rifle. Let's see if there's any way. Well, I could also harden the power armor. Might want to look into that. Fall out one turbo. So it seems like I should really go to the LA Boneyard first before going anywhere to destroy mutants because mutants are just way too strong for me right now. I need to go there anyway so I can harden the power armor, making it pretty much the best uh, armor in the game. I hate how these doors close so fast, so you have to kind of like book it into them. Alright, so we should really go to the LA Boneyard. Which I don't really know how to get to. <laughs> I know it's at the coast, so we should just go walking along the coast. Let's see, okay. Uh, I should probably make a save. Because I don't know if I'll run into anything weird when I'm traveling. <laughs> I've got a little shitty gun. Wait, I need to check real fast. How many... We're close to leveling up. So if we just kill a couple of things, we could level up. We'll see when we go across the land. The glow is too far down. Best thing to do is just go down this way. Oh, we ran into something. Oh, it's just...
See? See, just wandering the waste, trying to survive. Okay. <sighs> Gotta go, guys. Just random Brotherhood soldiers. Weird to run into them. Just keep wandering down so we can get to the coastline, so we can find the L.A. Boneyard. Keep going. Found something. Oh, okay. I think this is where we can get the Red Rider BB gun. Hi, I'm Bob. Hi, Bob. <laughs> if I'm not able to pick a lock, just do it again. I'm going to shoot my eye out. I don't even talk to the Bob dude. I just grab this shit and go. See, there's the Red Rider BP gun. Good to have more gun. And apparently it's alright. Somehow it does damage. Anyway, we need to travel more down. Oh, my neck hurts. As always. Let me just follow across the line. Random fuckheads. Raider, okay. Sometimes I confuse the raiders with Ian. <laughs> He's like, you hurt my friend! And it's like, well, I've got a giant ass fucking gun, so how about you just go home? Should probably also upgrade. Let's see. Probably more into energy weapons. Just because, like, I've turned from using regular ass guns to using uh, the plasma rifle and the uh, energy blaster. Energy blaster. Uh, I mean, the uh, alien blaster. <laughs> What's this area? Um. Alright, good. Where am I? Apparently this is the boneyard. Oh! That's what that thing was meant to do. <laughs> I never knew that it actually had a function. Welcome to Atrium. So can I ask you a few questions? What do you do here? The regulators, it's our job to keep peace in the atrium. Tell me about the boneyard. East of us are the followers. They're a bunch of peace nuts. East are the blades, a bunch of skags. If you ask me, and way south is the cathedral where the children have their religious center. Be peaceful and happy and they don't realize the world's too harsh for them. Children have some sort of god they worship in their cathedral to the south. They have a hospital, but they're a little too weird to be on the level. Let's see, how can I get inside? Sorry, but we have to care for those strangers too. Too dangerous. Maybe you could do some work for Zimmerman. Who's Zimmerman? Stern man in his thirties. Good day, can I make assistance? One important I'm Caleb. I train and organize the regulators here. You tell me about the atrium. Nice town. Regulators work hard. Who runs the atrium? The atrium is run by Jan John Zimmerman. Upright fella. Takes good care of town. If you need anything. 
Let's see, where can I find Simmerman? We'll find him in the big building to the southwest. Uh, he'll let you know what you're looking for. Some help with the blades. Okay. Big building in the southwest. I don't see no nothing in the southwest. There's no, like, accessible things right now. And a white smock. I'm Miles. What can I do for you? What are you studying? I'm a chemist. Mostly I'm a primer and powder so we can reuse the brass castings for bullets. Let's see. Well, I've been trying to get some strong acid Smitty can use for etching. Okay, thank you for random info. I'm looking for a way to get you to harden the armor. Nobody in here. Maybe they mean this building. That's kind of big. Good day, what can I do you? May I ask your name? I recall a Smitty because I'm the local blacksmith. Let's see. Can I ask for you for a few questions? Where's your shop equipment? What do you make here? Nothing else. Okay. There's no John Zimmerman here. Oh. I might have you ever dealt with a vicious murdering band of thieves before? Let's see. I've dealt with a few. Good, then you know how ruthless bloodthirsty they can be. Blades are the worst of them all, I'm afraid. We're a humble God-fearing town that is only trying to survive and our children. Let's see, what do you mean prey on you? Well, the regulars keep them from attacking outright, but it's all they can keep safe. They sneak at night and kill our citizens and do so and kidnap our children. And Just last week, one of them burst north in the middle of the thing and strapped to his body and blew up the regulars' barracks. No doubt it was weakening us so enough so they could launch a full-scale attack. What happened to him? Luckily, the regular killed him before he could complete his plan. I saw his body myself. So, you didn't actually see this. Okay, that's sad. Let's see. Sounds good to me. Aw, his son died. Hmm. That's sad. I guess I'll get revenge for you, random dude. Ian's just stuck over there. I guess he got stuck in a door. How do I get to the uh, blades, anyway? So, can I ask you a few questions? Let's see. Tell me about the boneyard. East are the blades. A bunch of skags. Okay. Okay. We need to go east so we can get to the blades. What the... How the hell do I end up here? I'll just look up where the blades are, just to make sure. See, he said he just wants uh, her dead. I'll ask her what's going on. I mean, his son died, but I'll ask her what he's been doing. See, hey lad, I'm looking at it today. Tell me about the blades. A good group of people is what the blades are. Stuck here between the damn regulators and the death claws ain't... <laughs> Let's see, who are you? I'm 
Macray. I help the blades and some against the death claws and the regulator bunch. Teach them a bit about protecting themselves about the nasties. See, what's the deal with the regulators? I'm thinking. I was thinking the death claws were the spawn of unnatural sight, but the regulators are evil. Come once a month or so, and they show their ugly faces and drag a father away from its wee ones. Sounds bad. See, what does that mean? Spawn of unnatural sort. But M regulators are evil. Come once a month or so and they show their ugly faces and drag a father away from its wee ones. Jeez. There's blood on both sides. And there's a lot of people in here. Why do you all live here? It's not as bad as it seems. The regulators and the death claws cause problems, but our leader, Razor, has helped us a great deal in the past months, and more recently, McRae has been showing us how to protect ourselves. Better. Okay. Why does it seem that the blades are not actually bad people? It doesn't look like they're horrible people. Or can I help you? Are you the leader of this gang? Gang, we're hardly a gang. Why? But I am the one they all come for direction. A gang. I wish we were a gang. At least we'd have a decent weapons to defend ourselves with. See, so you defend yourselves from who? We need better weapons. The gun runners, a little ways from here, have better weapons, but we can't get to them. Why can't you? There's a death claw nest between us and them. We've never spoken to any of the gun runners, and the regulators have firepower to clear out the death claws, but they don't for some reason. I don't understand. Like, are the blades or are the? Uh... I don't understand. <laughs> Persecuted by the regulators who coerce them to doing their bidding and frame them for crimes against the people of the Atrium. Oh. So the the son was executed by the father. What is my last save? Seems like it's better if I try to... <laughs> we loaded all the way back there. I jumped a bit because I was like, wait, what? But I... I think I made the decision to help the... Uh, The, um, what are they, the blades instead of the, uh, regulators from what I see on the wiki. Seems like they're a better group of people. I'd rather just help the people who are good, because it seems like the regulators are just, like, attacking a bunch of people who can't defend themselves. Oh. Oh, this is where you, I don't really care about that. Anyway real reason we're going there is just to harden the power armor and get a turbo rifle. Uh, but... Oh, great cons. They're just raiders. Got them. <laughs> you definitely hit them. No, don't hit dog meat. He's a good dog meat. 
Got him. Alright, I leveled up. Because that was the same level up I had earlier. Just add everything back to energy weapons, and now I'm at level 59 with them. We're just going for the boneyard, because we definitely need that gear. What's this? Oh, we ran into something. Bunch of rats. Okay. What if I just... I'm just gonna punch him. That was easy. <laughs> keep punching the shit out of him. I've got enough strength to just kind of keep hitting them. Punching random rats. Die, rat. How'd you miss a rat? <laughs> He's not that great at uh, winning fights against rats, is he? Okay, we need to... I'm thinking this is the boneyard. Yes, this is. I don't have any use for him. We're not going to help him. From what I figure out, the blades are a much better choice. Let's see, what can you tell me about the blades? Apparently they're saying that she's a good person, so I'd rather help the good person. I mean, I wouldn't want to help the guy who fucking slaughtered his own son, and his son's name was Jason, so... <laughs> I gotta avenge my fellow Jason. Let's see... What? See, the atrium put us in this position. They keep putting us down. Use our friends and families like animals. Why don't you fight them? Let's see. A little ways from here have weapons, but we can't get to them. Why can't you? Let's see. Gun runners are over to the east and north of here. Be careful. Let's see. Death claws are not to be taken lightly. Seems like uh, we're gonna fight some death claws. We haven't fought any death claws yet. It's time to go on a journey to murder someone. Or murder a bunch of death claws. It's always just so weird to watch him run. Is this the gun runners? Map. Warehouse. Oh. Time to pull out the alien blaster. I don't know if it will be of much help to these. Switch over to my... Five hit points. 
no damage, five hit points. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know. Damn, knock me down. Get up. Got him. Thousand experience. Let's see, we don't have a lot of uh, gear left, do we? Can I doctor myself back up? Seven hit points. Fail to do any healing. I don't have a time limit now, so I just keep trying to heal myself. Fail to do any healing. Alright. It is giving me experience the more I do this. It's just that my healing skill is not that great. <laughs> Damn. If I could just avoid the death claw over there. I could try and kill him since it didn't take that long last time. Gotta get through the gun runners. So I think these are the people with the guns. See, what's your business here? I speak to your boss, it's very important. I'm Zack. Sorry to bother you. Can I help you? What's that you do here? We manage your effects, your weapons. Supplying your materials. We've stripped the area surrounding our factory. Now all we have is to rely on Atrium for raw materials. At first it was fine. They... This place for raw materials. We manufactured and sold the weapons. That was three years ago. Zack hired some... Zimmerman hired some mercenaries to protect it. Those regulars are cold-hearted bastards. They're squeezing us for all we have. It's rough. Which... We could, but moving is a major undertaking. Just exterminate them. We've gone over there and taken out a few, but they've always seemed to come back. Besides, we're mercenaries, not fighters. Well, if you give me... What if you give me one and it took care of them for you? If you could get rid of the death clause once and for all, we could name you a price. I have some friends who could really use some of your weapons. It's, if you clear out the death clause, all of them, then you've got yourself a deal. Alright, I'll do it. Time to kill more death clause. I have the alien rifle. It's pretty much... I keep calling it the alien rifle. It's the alien blaster. Keep fucking it up. Either way. I could take him down pretty easy, because they always focus me. They don't focus dog meat or uh, Ian. I need to use this on myself. I can take quite a lot of damage. And one thing I'm glad about is that uh, armor doesn't degrade. 
so I don't have to worry about me running out of armor, like my power armor breaking. Sure, it's kind of a pain to fucking keep doing that. And the later Fallout games uh, did it much better with stim packs and equipping. I need to switch over. There's like two. Okay. One outside and one inside. We should be ready for anything. I'm thinking there's only one inside, but if there's another one, we may have a problem. hit for anything. Probably want to go for the eye. Uh, let's see, it was hit critically for, ooh, slipping past the huge cause to strike the monster. I did a lot of damage. Dogmeat just wants to walk up and hit him. Let's see. Go for the head. Got him. <sighs> okay. There's only one more. It's coming for us. Can't do much. Sully up. See, I gotta go for his left leg. Try and cripple him. Okay. Hit him in the eyes. Missed. Okay, he's actually not doing that much. We got him. All right, we got 2,000 experience from that. Death claws are good experience. Not as good as repeatedly doing a lock pick a million times, but passable. <laughs> they have a lot of health, but I'm guessing that's like them and super mutants are the most. Uh, strongest. Gabriel, it's very important. Yeah, I remember you. Go on. I cleared out all the death claws for you. Let's go kill the regulators. They seem like assholes. Let's see. Why don't you get my visitors? Didn't I already do it? I've killed all the death claws. We need to be sure. We've killed over 20 in the past two years, and they always seem to come back, and we could never figure out how. Let's give it a few days, and if they're still gone, we'll see what we can do for you. Uh, Pip. Can I not rest for a couple days? Yeah, you really could. I need you guys to hold off an army is the problem. 
Okay, let's see if we could pip. Not rest at this location. Let's see, we need to give it a couple days. So let's give it like a week or so. I also need to make sure to save. Gerg. I don't see any more death claws here. So let's sleep. We'll sleep where the death claws slept. Let's see. Hmm. Sleep until healed. Sleep until morning. Sleep until midnight. Sleep for six hours. Six hours. Okay. I'm thinking that might be enough to let them kind of help me out. I don't see any death claws. And the whole reason we're out here is just because the Overseer thought, like, oh no, they're going to come and get us. Talk to the gun runner. Let's see, I've killed all the death claws. Few days. Well, I've given you a few days. Few usually means three. Maybe I'll go tell Razor that uh I got rid of those death claws. Oh, they're back. I didn't even know. So. He shot me for some reason. Missed. Oh shit, I reloaded when I shouldn't have. Damn. Got him. I guess if I wanted to, I could just keep grinding here. Uh, I'm a little, I'm a little bit of ways from doing that. I'm trying to see if there's. Anything here that I need to do to try and get them to stop. Oh, there's a basement? Oh, I, I see it now. I didn't even know. There's a mother death claw we have to kill. That's a fucking hell of a trip. Okay. 
Okay, make sure we save. Okay. She's coming. I'm gonna make sure I equip my plasma rifle in case of... I guess I need it, maybe. It does less damage, but I can also kind of... I think it can do rapid fire. No, it can't. And the turn... Okay. Uh... Hit him for a little bit. Only got hit for a little bit. Let's see. The fuck? Why did I hit him? I'm gonna reload. Because I don't want dog meat to hurt. Spend a turn. Damn. Alright, let's see. Super close. Let's see, can I get a... Let's see. Aim for the head. Got him. Death claws are not that uh, tough right now. See, go for the torso. <laughs> Dog meat's just kind of hitting as much as it can, but it it doesn't really do much damage, does it? Every time it hits me, it doesn't do any damage, really. Okay, and then we need to do a, do it on the head. How much damage does this thing take? Dog meat's not doing any damage. Fuck, it did a little bit. I died. Try again. The problem is that I just don't get too lucky with hits, really. Let's see. I need this for range, really. Got him. Got a crit. You just gotta hope that it doesn't get crits. Please don't get crits. It's a lot of attacks. I'm gonna save mid battle so that I can not lose out on all those good hits I've done so far.
Hmm. Well, I killed Ian. It ate Ian. Weird as fuck. Okay. Why does it keep killing him? <laughs> Critically hit for no damage. Reload again. Okay, so maybe I should not try and go for the head. It just, it hits Ian for some reason. <laughs> Damn, crit. Okay. How many fucking bolts of damage do you need? Finally! The Death Claw has been slaughtered. Now her young remain. <laughs> Let's. Put a save right here so that we can get the young and murder all of them. Okay. Mother Deathclaw is dead. Now I can walk away in peace. And be completely sure that we got rid of him. Oh my head. Let's make a save. To make sure that we don't lose this little adventure. Okay, so we're going to end for now. We've been going for a pretty long time. So next time we're going to try and get the gun runners and the blades to be happy so that we can use the uh, upgraded power armor and plasma rifle.